<laughs> the baby. Is the other guy called the adult? My cock. <laughs> Ooh, my cock is here. Why? You're a red. Dude. Dumbass. I don't know which one my cock is. Go! <laughs> oh god, it's so strong. Nope. Oh, I touched him for a second and it killed him. <laughs> I just beat the shit out of my cock. Prepare to see one of the best builds that I have used in Elden Ring. Like, no joke, this build just happens to be completely freaking awesome. So I'm going to quickly explain a couple things to you before the actual invasions. Feel free to skip if you guys want, but this is basically going to have my build ideas and like the build itself. So I have two different characters, really. I have one at around rune level 50, then I have another character at rune level 140, which is kind of like my main one where I beat the game at. So this build was really meant for rune level 50. Like that's what I was thinking in my head. I was like, this is gonna work really well down here. And to be honest, it just didn't work the way I wanted it to at rune level 50. While it wasn't bad, the results that I got just weren't anywhere of what I wanted. I had a couple of different ideas as well for the build. One of the obvious ones that I'm sure a lot of people are thinking of is the whole Braird armor set, the one that gives you a little bit of damage for rolling. I think it's something like one or two damage per roll per armor piece. So I thought in my head, oh, if I use all the armor piece and then also roll into people, will I be doing that extra damage? And after a little bit of testing, it just didn't really seem worth it to have basically very little poise for something that's also not going to be doing a lot of damage. Now, I'm sure a lot of you guys could be a lot more successful than I was with this build, specifically because I was using it on a very bad weapon. I wanted specifically to just use the left trigger attack, and I didn't really want to have, I guess, a really good weapon that I could just rely on. And then, you know what, when I'm like, all right, this isn't working, I'm going to go ahead and just R1 and spam R1 and jumping attacks. Like, I didn't really want that. I wanted it to be just about the GOAT or the ram or whatever you know i'm gonna keep calling it the goat i like calling it the goat but that armor set just didn't really work out the way i wanted so out the window it went next i thought what if i just go ahead and have a bunch of poise now at rune level 50 it just sadly didn't really work out for one you don't have a lot of options because you're very limited with the amount of actual levels that you have like 50 isn't really too much and the way the over leveled phantoms in this game are you just take way too much damage for the little amount of health that you're gonna have if you're putting in a bunch of points into like endurance and stuff where you're basically getting too hit by some of these crazy crazy over leveled phantoms making it just completely unfair so sadly that didn't work out too well at rune level 50. so then i decided to go on my 140 character and to be honest i kind of thought it wasn't really going to do too well on there because i thought i'm just going to be invading gankers who will destroy me with rivers of blood and basically like two shot me every single time and run away and use spells Little did I know. Ah! That one of the best builds for rune level 140 would come out of this. So I decided to go with my full poise monster build. I also added a couple of buffs. I added a golden vow buff. I had my my flask giving me extra stamina and the the one that gives you extra lightning damage. I had rings that made my weapon art a little bit stronger like Shard of Alexander and the lightning talisman. And the main area that I really was invading at because that is like the biggest like gank spot where all the people just sit there waiting for invaders to gank them is the lake which just happens to be perfect for me because the water makes it so that they take about 20% more damage so with literally 100 poise and some pretty decent hyper armor when it comes to the weapons startup frames i was almost unstoppable after like a split second of pressing l2 if they try to attack with like almost anything i would poise right through it instantly the first hit 500 damage and i think that's the big part of this actual art of war that nobody expects it to do that much damage so then when they see that giant tick of damage 
they almost always start panicking and rolling backwards because nobody sees it, so nobody knows how to deal with it. So then when they start rolling backwards, you're basically going forward every single time and you hit them, you stagger them, get another hit, and you'll see in the video how quickly I wipe out some of these people, like literally in half a second, 2000 damage. So what you're about to see is legitimately one of the best builds and one of the most fun builds. And honestly, some of the most fun invasions that I've done because it's basically me just messing around. I think for like four hours that I recorded for this video, five hours, I don't think I really pressed R1 more than like five times. So to press just L2 and not use Rivers of Blood, I think you got a pretty nice build going here. Anyways, enjoy the rest of the video. If you do, maybe consider dropping a like and let me know if you end up trying it and uh, how successful it is for you. Thank you so much. Subscribe so you don't miss the next one and enjoy the rest of the video. What the hell? <laughs> what the fuck was even happening in there? Stop it. He's around here somewhere. There he is. Careful. Let me just say, you guys are both fucked. Come here! Yes! Double kill with one roll! <gasps> one HP! <sighs> I also don't think the flame grab me strength works. Let's see, does this get rid of the buff? It does. Okay, so they don't work together. Oh, we got a shield poking sh fucking at spur user. Rivers of blood, quick stepping, and spur shield dies to a goat. A goat! You die to a, a rolling goat! Good red, come to me. Come to me, my friend. Come here! Staggers me right out of it, huh? Yeah, keep rolling backwards. Keep rolling backwards. <laughs> There's one. Who flung poo is next. Goat is here. <laughs> when you get the goat going, the only thing that can stop me is bleed, frostbite, ganks, spells. Rolling a little bit to the left or to the right. Rolling forward. Um, grass. Two for old fingers. So this, none of these are even the host. Oh shit. Oh. Okay. Oh god, I can't see shit. Oh my god, there was so many things to roll. Or uh, spell spam as well. Can also stop me. That's also a good one. Did he have that madness one? Alright, so he's got Vike's spear. Can't madness to that fire. But god damn it, I'll try! Oh, oh, it didn't work there. I can't hit me. <laughs> I need just one more hit and I get madness. Nope. That 90 degree turn. Ha ha ha!
Ah, oh, I should've just done it there. Okay, I'll do a thousand damage. Let me go over here. Do it again! Here I come, bitch! Yeah! What HP? <laughs> oh my god, I had 12 HP! Holy shit! Oh, that was too dumb. This is not gonna go well. Maybe I catch them off guard. Maybe I catch somebody off guard because they don't take the build seriously. There's one. That's all I needed to catch one of them off guard. Let me reapply the buffs. Dodged it! Oh, that's a duelist. I thought that was a friend. What are you- what's he doing? Come here! Goats hit with their hooves sometimes. Oh, he's just running away. Come here. I don't know what you're doing. What are you doing? Are you just taking up a spot? I'm actually kind of curious. Okay, I need to kill the red. Come here then. I just need him to come forward and attack a little bit. If I'm fighting the red, he might do that. Perfect. Bye bye. <laughs> oh, I just needed to bait him a little bit. That's all you need for the dummies. Just a little bit of baiting. What's going on here? Oh boy. This fucking bleed build here. 1L1 bleed. Yep. Jesus Christ. Yeah. I don't think there's going to be much the goat can do here, you guys. I am but a little goat. <laughs> Never mind. Never mind. He's way more of an idiot than I thought. <laughs> Dog, how much damage? I did 1600 damage with three rolls. Jesus. It's this bleed guy again. I'm not really afraid of him, but I am afraid of that build. I'm scared of seeing of 1200 damage with one running attack. Come here. Okay, I already know that I do a fuck ton of damage to this guy. Okay, I'll go try to help this guy out. I guess all he really knows is a running attack, so as long as we dodge that, he doesn't catch us off guard, we should be okay. Bye bye! <laughs> oh, it's so easy against these dum dums. Man, a bleed build could make just about anybody pretty good. But, like, you gotta put in some effort, man. People actually doing PvE? That's impossible. Uh-oh. This dragon's gonna kill me, isn't it? What in the fucking shit? I didn't even see this guy. Come here, then. Come here. Oh, Bloodhound step. Okay. Here's the host. Okay. Go! Oh, how's that weapon working out for you, uh huh? Your turn now. Actually, I drink that. And that. Ow. Did you not hit me with your moon veil? Because I want to get that health back. Thank you. Come here. Come here. Don't run from me! Come here! Ah! Oh, it does 40 damage. <laughs> okay, I have all my stamina. I can chase him down pretty well now. Oh, never mind. Woo! Surprise! What the hell? Oh, who's that guy? There's another one? I don't know where the fuck this one came from. 
I didn't know there was another one. Dang it. Meep. Oh! Oh no! Hit the stupid dragon! Damn it! I didn't know there was another one! God damn it, you guys. Well, I killed one. I killed two. Stupid dragon. And there's somebody hiding somewhere. Yeah, he's right there. Don't run. I need an FP, not that one. What the hell? This scream is so bad for female characters. Ah! Dang it. Do a female goat have a different meep? What's the answer to this? You fucked up. Red! Oh, he almost killed me. You know you're gonna die, right, too? Oh boy. The red died. <laughs> Get away from me. Why does your thong look smaller? Where are you going? Ah, that's why. Who wins? Those guys are one little roly boy. I wonder. <laughs> See you, nerds. Ah.